Um, obviously, we already sort of touched on it as well in terms of news and things going on. Alex and Worthy moving over from OCE to play in NA this season. They already called for Globals. They called mm-hmm. Major One accidentally because the teams above them got banned. And so they got the cross what? Um, Not accidentally. So, I'm so, pretty so sure they tried to. <laughs> oh well, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you tried to get them banned. Yeah, no. well, yeah. They're... Shout out to OCE anyway, because you know the people that won got banned, so they got the spot. Um, funnily enough, when I was in Norway for the Mr. Savage snowball fight Red Bull video we recorded, Lachlan was there, and he had asked me like, "Hey, like, should we send like our guys out to uh, EU or NA for FNCS to like give them prac?" Um, and I had said an overwhelming yes, but send them to NA. Don't send them to EU. Send them mm-hmm. to NA. Um, and of course, naturally, I'm sure people hear that go, of course, Levin was biased because he thinks E is hard. Uh, da, 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 da. It wasn't even because of that. I was just like, from the perspective of like, send them to a country where they'll know their language. NA, like, they'll be around more pros. Maybe they can like chill with people. Mm-hmm. Like, it'll be more easy for them to like acclimatize to like being in the region. Whereas like, we saw what happened in like Vortex and, and, uh, sons came to eu that one season it's like they were just like depressed after three days because they were living in bumfuck germany somewhere mm-hmm. like it's just yeah like it just wasn't in fun germany, you know man. yeah it was just yeah it was just it was never going to be great so um i'm really excited to see alex and worthy i did see a clip <laughs> maybe i'll try to play it's gonna be like yeah it's the clicks yeah, one yeah it's probably gonna be like 30 fps but essentially clicks kills uh alex in a tournament yesterday was it solo Kashi solo Kashi. yeah yeah and uh, he was not the nicest to him after the fact. Let's just uh, let's just say that. Um, but what I do mean, we think of Alex and Webby coming over? A lot. We talked about it a little bit yesterday on, on, on my stream, and then basically the consensus I've come to is that they probably make grand finals easy because every top tier player from every single region will probably make grands on every other region, right? Because they're at that level. It's just, are they going to do good in the grand finals? Probably not. Are they going to get uncontested? Probably not. Even though they're a global qualified team, no one cares that's a global qualified team. They don't see the names. They see the region, and OCE is not a region. OCE, yeah, OCE is not a region. I, I <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's yeah. a very valid in the player, eyes but... of the Americans. Uh, yeah. not, not me personally. I, I love OCE. Well, yeah, this is just... what this is what Clicks had to say about it. Let's let's watch the clip here. Hopefully, it it, it works. Uh... And it's not too laggy. Nitro splash is so balanced, by the way. Yeah. For yeah. for the audio listeners, he is nitroing into a box and he kills Alex. You're not mad here, bro. You're fucking garbage here. Don't ever try to fucking key NA go. You understand me? Don't you ever try to key a fucking NA go. You don't know how it works around here. You really don't know how it works on here. You didn't even touch me the second I started fighting. He doesn't know how it works around him. He doesn't know. I guess he just doesn't <laughs> does, know how it does works. Does he know he doesn't know? He Somebody should have told him. Like, he yeah. just doesn't know. Like, uh, he, I mean, he should have known. Back on the, the uh, to, I mean, yeah, I mean, so cash get whatever, right? But the point, like, how they'll do in this season, right, is so from what it sounds like, they're going to go reckless and contest re and ritual. And now I'm not going to say that's the best idea, but if you're Alex and Worthy, right, you basically only have two plans. And like, is you you contest a, sh- a shit spot and you're never getting it on con because no one's going, oh, OC, let's not contest them. Or you contest a good spot and you're, they're obviously not leaving as well, right? Yeah. So I don't really know Reckless is e- either because you're contesting a team who's called Globals, but it's not actually that good of a spot. So I don't know how they're going to do my prediction before hearing everything. I wonder what your guys' prediction is for where do you think they're going to place on NA like early predictions. For me, I first when I first saw it, was like top 20, top 15, I felt like that's something they could do because I was like, they're probably going to get something better, either uncontested or contest like a god spot and get decent games from there. Now contesting Reckless, I might lower it a little bit. <laughs> I don't think that's exactly where I think they'll place now. Maybe like more like 30th, but I definitely see them in grand finals for sure, as you said, Boop. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I'm surprised they're landing reckless. I, I, I feel like it's, it's, it's that's the spot for like FNCS qualifiers and dual cash cups, and then when they qualify FNCS grand finals, they'll be like, we're gonna land somewhere else because why not? Like this is purely a content uh, move as alongside actually trying to improve and actually do well, right? Like they're making YouTube videos, they're probably gonna stream as well. They don't want to be dying on spawn. This is they want to have the profit come back into them plus the practice. 
and you're not practicing dino spawn to be because we're just gonna wq you anyways or spawn so you're not gonna be able to split reckless yeah. i do feel like they would have a chance of being uncon if they didn't go to a poi do you? i know you say people don't respect the region but like if you just happen to pick a split that nobody else really qualifies Lanza, from yeah. then like you can get on con you get Put a rebels roost. On, like, on eu sometimes getting on con on splits just because mm -hmm. nobody else really landed there but uh, yeah that's just down to luck in the end too honestly the, the real money move would have been landing on clicks and benno and just like streaming everything <laughs> lachlan in the viewing yeah. party or going over to or going mm -hmm. like they're not they're not making business moves <laughs> yeah they're not smart enough yeah that, that's low-key a cook you know yeah I don't Maybe. think they're really. If they're, if they're yeah. the calling now, I'm gonna get a lot of shit for that. By the way, yeah. <laughs> like, wait, the so... landing clicks in Venom now? Fuck. Oops, fault. Yeah. Yeah, it's my fault. But I don't think they're guaranteed to call brands. Um, mm. I kind of agree that they could place like top fifteen, top twenty, but that, I wouldn't say they're guaranteed to call brands either. Like people thought with, uh, what was it, King, King and Phaser on EU, like they were yeah. pretty likely to call brands, but didn't in the end and they didn't really show that much that said they should call brands either mm -hmm. yeah nah i think it was clear. i think it'll be clear like from what we see this week come uh the cash cup today like i think the cash up today will be a good tell because i think with king and phaser it was like you could kind of instantly tell that they were a team where it would be in question whether they make grands or not like from their well, they were tournaments. supposedly the best in Brazil, which is a better region than OCE, right? Well, well yeah, they, yeah, they, King and Faisal were like very hyped up, and like people said that they would be good. But again, it was just like even the people who were like, yeah, yeah, they'll do good here. It was like as soon as we saw that first cash cup, people uh -huh. who know about Fortnite were like, mm, mm. actually, who yeah. knows? So like, I wonder how they'll do today, Alex and Worthy. And if they do decent, then maybe I'll have a bit more hope. But if again it looks a bit rocky, then you know you go, you sort of go from there. Hey, if you enjoyed that video, you can watch the full podcast right here. Just click on it, watch the full episode. You, you've already watched this video. You might as well watch the full podcast right here. Go on, click it.